Hi! Welcome to the Belbic Toolbox presentation. The first thing to do is to get the software files. Go to the MATLAB file exchange website and download it. You must be registered to perform this operation. If you do not have an account you can easily get one. It's free. Save the zip file in any place on your hard disk drive and then uncompress it. You can leave it where it stands or move it to another directory. I prefer to put it under the MATLAB installation folder. Next, you need to run MATLAB as administrator. In order to do this, just click the right mouse button over the MATLAB icon and select Run as Administrator. In MATLAB, browse for the Belbic folder. Make it the current MATLAB folder. Identify the install me M file and run it. The toolbox will be installed and the MATLAB session automatically restarted. Open Simulink and let's take a look at the Belbic Toolbox content. Three main clusters can be seen. One with common features, other with the continuous time implementation, and the third with the discrete time version. To illustrate some of the toolbox features, let's see an example. Our aim is to build a Belbic controller for a DC-DC buck converter. Let's assume that the transfer function is known. The control signal is a modulation index between 0 and 1 and the output signal is the converter voltage.
In this case, a continuous time Belba controller will be used. The controller input signals are coming from a reward generator and a stimuli generator. The former is obtained by passing the output signal through a PID structure. The latter is a weighted sum taken from the error in the control signal. The Bellbook performance strongly depends on its parameterization. In this case, the controller gains were obtained after trial and error. The last step is just to adjust the simulation time and click the simulation button. Additional examples, that illustrate the main features of this toolbox, are available in the examples folder in the Bellbook directory. Thank you for your attention.